That's why you left the temple and ran away, isn't it? The great tournament was too much responsibility. But vengeance... That's so much simpler. Listen. You have been chosen to defend the realm of Earth in a tournament called Mortal Kombat. Your world is but one of many realms. One of them is a forsaken land called Outworld, ruled by an immortal who has crowned himself Emperor. Three warriors have been chosen above all others as the last best hope for the realm of Earth. Liu Kang, slain by Billy Fox. Lieutenant Sonya Blaze, U.S. Special Forces, and Johnny Cage, famous Hollywood star. These three do not know why they have been chosen for this mystical and mysterious tournament. None realizes that this boat is taking them to the greatest adventure of their lives. None of them yet understands the power of the magic which surrounds the tournament of mortal combat. Or why so many warriors who came before them fail. Much has changed since the last Mortal Kombat tournament. Dark forces of Outworld have begun invading the Earth realm. These attacks are seriously weakening Earth's dimensional fabric, enabling not only Outworlders to enter the Earth realm, but warriors from other domains as well. Only the most extraordinary warriors could possibly meet this challenge. Exterior 2. But now that these nomad know their way here, I've got to ship them to a realm of no return. You hide behind a human? Surrender, Ring, or this one dies. Then I will take your generals, because Earth does not bend to the will of tyrants. Never give up hope. At least not so early in the fight. Raiden? It's a new look. Who's the girl? Can she fight as good as she looks? <laughs> Better. Good, because I was expecting a team of fighters. Instead, I hear fighters at war with each other. Oh, give us a break, Raiden. We've been through hell. Compared to what lies ahead, you've been through nothing. This is not about blame. We're together in this. Each of us must help and support the others, like a family. Our battle with Shinnok's forces is over. I must move on to my new position as an Elder God. And you, Fujin, you must take my former position as protector of Earth. Take special care of the mortals of Earth. They are a great people, but have the ability to self-destruct. Be patient, and offer your wisdom and guidance. Do you realize what you've done? I was just earning my living. Your clan's ignorance and greed will cost this entire realm. You'll now have to set things straight. Quan Chi could simply be a lunatic sorcerer. I never heard of an elder god named Shinnok, or of a place called the Nether Realm. You better start believing in both, because you're going to the Nether Realm, and you're going to bring back the amulet. We must act quickly. I have no dominion in the Nether Realm. You are reality's only hope. What a great idea. That's great. Of course. Let's quit. You'll quit? I'll quit? Earth Realm, you're on your own. Maybe you should try harder. Look farther. Do you think it's possible there might be someone out there who's as good, or dare I say it, better than you? Yes, of course it's possible, but you always said it rested on me. To find new fighters. So if you do lose, there's a new victor to take your place. Look, you are good. If you play your cards right, you could live forever. Or not. You're mortal. Mortals die. Once again, the threat to Earthrealm has been vanquished. The deadly alliance is no more. What dangers lie in the future, I can no longer foresee. Perhaps the Dragon King will in fact return. Perhaps the depths of the Netherrealm will spew forth a legion of only. Even the vampire people pose a threat to peace now that Outworld is in chaos. But one thing is certain. Earthrealm must be protected. Greetings, champion. I have need of your assistance. Quan Chi possesses an item created by the Elder Gods, an amulet that acts like a key. He understands only a fraction of its potential, but enough to use it to escape from hell. 
You have ensured peace for Earth once again this day. But there is no power in these medals apart from the knowledge you must carry into every battle. That no one is a champion alone. If one of us is in chains, none of us are free. Do not go through that portal. I have struck a deal with the Emperor. Shao Kahn will honor Earthrealm's independence when his forces have won. Because in return, I will prevent you from completing your quest. Let me out of this place. You know we're unable to do that. You don't understand. If you don't let me go... Yes, you've explained this to me before. The Earth will be overtaken by Shao Kahn. Yes. And if you don't let me attend the Mortal Kombat tournament, I promise you, all of you will die. Time is running out. We have to move now. They're never gonna let you out of here, you know that. Maybe one day they will. Well... You're the only one who can help me. Please. Johnny Cage. Looks like a party. How much electroshock am I gonna need to get your people out? Trust me, you're not a candidate. I'm sorry, Johnny. I'm very real. So is Shang Tsung. I'm glad you refused to join him. So, who are you supposed to be anyway? I'm Raiden, God of Thunder. <laughs> and you're not crazy. <laughs> But it's extremely important that you listen to what I'm about to tell you. The fate of the world could depend upon it. And after I said my piece, should you choose not to follow me, I promise to leave you hallucination free. The realms are in constant flux. They shift and change like an endless dream. Shao Kahn's defeat should have marked our victory against the threatened merge of Earthrealm and Outworld. Instead, it heralded a new struggle for independence. Your invasion of Earthrealm violated the rules of mortal combat, Shao Kahn. Your Tar Cotton Horde has been routed by the forces of light. Even now, your allies desert you. Gratitude is unnecessary. I have foreseen events, like memories of my future. They lead me to believe that you are all connected to Earthrealm's fate. What have you foreseen? In my visions, Shao Kahn becomes invincible. He destroys all life in Earthrealm. We will all die. I believe these flashes are a guide to defeating Shao Kahn, but disrupting the flow of time can have serious consequences. When Kano misappropriated Shinnok's amulet, he left behind a snare. Disabling it required that I travel to many strange realms. I must retire to the Jinsei chamber, regain my strength. Quan Chi's magic binds the souls of many we hold dear. Capture him, and we can force him to release them. I've long regretted losing our comrades' souls to Netherrealm's evil. Kung Lao and Liu Kang, they were like sons. I would move the heavens to bring them back to the light.